Hey guys. Alright. I'm having a a wow moment. I just wow. Wow did I just get blown away. Oh wow. It was epic. It was epic. I thought it was over. Okay, I thought the wow moment for a day was over. It involves the chair. How I ended up outside in the first place to realize that it had been delivered when it's not supposed to be delivered until Monday. How it just, the right timing that I was out in the alley away from my house, watch some guy pull up in the other alley, stop, and look at where my package had been. He was stopped for so long that I'm standing there like, what the fuck? He's looking at my house where the package was and realized that I had I had dragged it into the house. I saw him do that. Okay. I was going to make iced tea. This last one really got me shook up. I think you could hear it in my voice. It's real. Oh, wow. Okay, so... <gasps> I realized I was low on iced tea. I was going to boil water and uh, make, make some sweet tea. So... I didn't have to pay for it. You know, at the store, I already got tea bags. And, and mine is better anyway. And, uh... I forgot to boil the water. That's what I went out there for. I forgot to boil the freaking water. And what I did is I cut the bacon in half like I usually do. And I started frying a half a pound of bacon. I cut the, there was so much fat off of, off the end. Um, and then I looked at the other half and I'm like, there's so much fat on that end too. I might as well make the whole pound. I never do that. But I was out in the kitchen long enough to do two panfuls, you know, of, of bacon and I, I didn't remember that whole time to put water on to boil for tea bags. Mm -hmm. Where are my pills? Where are my pills? Where are my pills? Hello. Uh, so, um, anyway, I eat the bacon and all that. And, you know, it did whatever through the day. You know, this wall is really weird. What's up with this wall? It's, it's bubbling because it's so fucking cold. The paint is bubbling on that fucking wall. Look at this. Like, what the fuck? What the fuck? Really? Really? Whoa, that's massive. It's on both sides. Okay, stop being distracted. <clears throat> okay, 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 okay. So I'm in here and I realize, hey, I forgot to boil that water. There's, there's nothing to drink now. I drank it all and I forgot all about making more. I gotta go buy some. Timing, guys. Timing is everything. And uh, I geared up and I go outside and I see the box for my chair, my new chair. It's the first piece of furniture I bought in at least 20 years, okay? Except for a used baby crib. So, I'm pretty sure it's about 20 years. Anyway. I see the box. I don't like where it's at. Um, because you know, it's visible to people. And, and people steal packages. So I, I don't like when they, they set it at the corner. I think they did it because of so much snow. 
and they didn't feel like l lugging that big thing back to the gate, okay, and, and around the side, because they usually bring it to my stairs. But they left, he left it, he didn't even put it on the side of the house. He left it out at the corner of the fucking house, like dumb, right? And it's in a box, brand new, I could just, I could just picture and hear somebody calling somebody else like, hey, dude, hey, you got a truck, man, check it out. There's this brand new chair. Apparently nobody even knows it's sitting there. Hey, you grab it. If you just say you thought it was garbage, you thought somebody was throwing it out the garbage, it's garbage day. You know, go grab that while you can. It's brand new, I swear to God. I swear something like that went down. After I, I got the chair in and it took, I'm not even telling you the effort that it took me to get it in the house. And uh, with with all that snow, it it still didn't scrape the ground. It's 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 just like a slide. You could you could tell I slid it, drudged it through the snow. That's it. But it, you don't you just you still don't see the ground. That's how deep it is. So I got it in the house eventually. And once I was satisfied, okay, you're good. Now I'm gonna go to Seven Eleven. I'm gonna buy the tea. Okay. And I go. And, and and I'm 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 out of my area, off my property, and I start walking. I'm out in the alley, and I'm like halfway past the neighbor's house, and I stop and I look at a truck that was coming from the alley that's right there, right? And he came through and he stopped and he's looking at the corner of the house right here, and he's staring at it. I'm in. I'm stopped looking at the alley like you ain't looking for traffic because you you turn your head a little bit more and you would notice me standing here looking right at you like what the fuck you looking at my house for, motherfucker? And then all of a sudden he shook his head no, and he went, he was stopped. He was stopped and he was looking. He didn't just stop and he's doing something else with his hands waiting like I'm going to do a text right now or something. No, he's looking at my fucking house. I'm standing there watching him look at my house where the box just was and his wheels spinning in his brain like, oh, I can see the track marks that lead to that door. It's not there anymore. It's gone. Oh, we just missed it. And he's shaking his head like, no, it's not there no more, to the chick sitting beside him. The timing got me to see that, too. Because I could have went out there an hour before and found it there for all I know. You know what I mean? That's the first, first piece of furniture I bought in 25 years. You know? And, and boom. It could have been gone. But no, the universe doesn't work like that. Uh, whether it's the universe, God alien i don't know what the hell's going on because what i got to tell you now is really going to freak you out if this this is what got me what you think that's coincidence i don't care you want to chalk things up to coincidence that's okay now i mentioned before that when i find dimes okay it reminds me of my dad all all, all money any money that i find is going to remind me of my dad it just does now and um, especially when it's silver and dimes dimes really that's my dad's calling card Okay, I'm in the store. I find a dime and a quarter in the store at the same time. They were together. I put them in my coat pocket. There's nothing else in that pocket. So I just sat them in there and I'm going, you know, getting all I bought a lot of stuff I bought like 21 something was the total I got like eggs and bread and all kind of stuff <coughs> so so anyway earlier today I had been saying different ways because I have I have a cousin um four cousins from Iran Nusheen Jolay Royale and Paravani I say Paravani. That's the way I said it. That's the way my grandmother said it. That's the way my family said it, it was Paravani. Okay, but when when you hear her mother or her sister, if they were calling her or something, they would say it like Parvane, 
parvenu, you know, with the accent in it. So I, I was thinking that earlier today, and I was saying it out loud. I was saying, and then, and then I, it, it came to my mind that parvenu means Jennifer. Because she told me that. Her other sister didn't tell me what their names meant. But she says, you know, I'll say Paravane because I feel more comfortable with that. That's the way I, I grew up saying it. So Paravane means Jennifer in English. It, it, that's how it translates. And it means butterfly. Okay? So as I'm standing here telling you about split second you know the timing is everything and they were going to steal my chair and the universe wouldn't have it that way and I think of my dad when I find change and hey I find change a day uh, it was a dime and a quarter and then I says you know what I should go check out that the eagle on the back of the quarter and see if there's a red mark on it I swear to god I did I swear and um where'd I put it because I could barely see it myself, but I'm, I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure there's a butterfly on this. Because I was saying out loud. Paravane, 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 you know, both ways. I was saying, I don't know why. I don't know why. And then I I imagine, like I had a visual, imagine, you know, thing going on, like daydream kind of thing. And there, a little girl um, with, at the cat. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. That's where I found the freaking money. That's where I found it. Oh, my God. Another revelation. Um, so, 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 uh, um, so the little girl, her name was Jennifer, and I said, Jennifer means butterfly. And I, and I imagined myself telling her that. But I remember saying, Paravane, Paravane, you know, I've seen it both ways, and then I, I found them both. <laughs> it's got a butterfly on the back. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm freaking out over it. I'm, re I'm, I'm really freaking out over, over this one. Cause, I mean, that's uh, that. You know, the dime is my dad's calling card, and and uh, you know, I I don't know I don't know why my cousin came to my mind. You know, and is it and 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 uh, <laughs> it's it. <laughs> It's like saying, uh, it's like validation. It's like validation to all this stuff that it's, it feels, it feels like, like it's just odd timing. Sometimes it's, it might not be something out of the ordinary, but the timing is, is, is so peculiar, you know, uh, and, and unusual and, 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 and that it makes it significant. The timing is everything, and I've been saying that, and I've been thinking that, and I've, you know what I mean? That's, that's messed up. That's, that's like, that's insane. That, because I told this story about how I found, I told, if, if it's going to be from my dad, I want a red mark on Eagle. You know, I told you that story recently, so I, I just was laughing. I was like, hey, I wonder if there's a red mark on the Eagle on the back of the quarter I found. And there's no Eagle on the back, you know. And then as I'm looking at it and looking at it closer, you know, I, I just, I was like, wait a minute. Is that a butterfly? And I can't, I can't really see it, not even with my glasses on, but I'm pretty I think it says, like, tall grass in Kansas. And I, it might be a pheasant, okay, but what I, what I can see is that that's a butterfly. I don't, is that a butterfly? I think it's a butterfly, and that's freaking me out. It's freaking me out so bad because it's real. This is what I talk about all the time, you know?
that I just got my chair. I just got it just in time before somebody stole it. Just in the nick of time to see that somebody was actually eyeing it up. You know, not because otherwise I would have just brought it in the house. I wouldn't know nothing about it, you know. But no, I saw the guy staring it up. That's the timing of it. It wasn't just, hey, the chair's going, the time that I just got it, just in time, and I saw him, you know. And then the calling card, while I was gone, after I saw that, the calling card right there, right in front of me at the cash register, and I picked it up. And that is where I imagined myself because, I, you know, I don't go anywhere. So why am I going to imagine myself in this fancy hotel? It's like it was a more realistic thing that if, you know, a little child, I heard her name was Jennifer. And I, says, I, I said, Jennifer means butterfly. Just mentally I did that, you know. And, and, and then there's, okay, I'm ending the video. I took, I took, I took the pills and I threw the bottle. Okay, so it was the last two. It's not like I took the whole bottle. <laughs> I guess I did take the whole bottle over the course of the last month. Uh, but um, anyway, okay, okay. All right. Guys, if you, if you want to know about more of this kind of stuff, like stay tuned to my channel because I tried making a video just before this. And... It, and I was, because I was stuck on stupid, and I, I was repeating out loud over and over again, like, yeah, do it with intent. Like, do something now with intent, and I'm thinking, what can I, what can I do with intent? And the freaking phone cut off, and I was like, oh, you're kidding me. It stopped recording. So... Anyway, my lovely new chair that is very, very soft, and I'm going to love it to death. It, it's here. It's safe, and, and um, it's comfortable. I can lay in it, but for right now, I'm just going to stay right here. This is extra soft. I made it extra soft with this blanket, and right now, I'm just uh, I'm on the floor. I'm having a solo sleepover. Just me and THC, <laughs> you know, and uh, oh, that's what I named my shadow creature Psycho. <laughs> I named him Zipper. Peace out, guys. God bless. I'm gonna finish watching my Dead Zone. No, Dead, dead Something, Dead Files, Dead Files. Oh, yeah, okay, God bless.